So we continued our series on exchange tra traded versus um, over the counter markets. And one topic which gets used a lot is the topic of uh, last look versus no last look. So yes or no. So the concept of last look is is basically shocking to anybody who trades on exchange. So for now, we're just going to explain how an exchange, uh, like do a brief primer of how an order book works. If you want to kind of really get the ins and outs of that, we've got a separate video on that, which I encourage you to watch. But let's say we've got an order book where here's the guys selling and here's the guys buying. So this is the, the price goes this way down from, from here, right? So the, the guys who want to offer the least to buy are here. The guys who want the most to sell are up here. And at some point, you've got the top of the book, TOB, where demand and supply are closest for any given quantity, which is typically narrow liquidity. So let's say 10 lots in uh, retail FX markets. So if, if we're talking about equities here, if somebody comes in with either a limit order or a market order and they hit on this offer to purchase, mm -hmm. then the deal's done. Yeah. Okay. It's you know, it's a queue. It's uh, you know, what, what do you call it? Um, for whoever gets it gets it, right? It's the, yeah. the, the, that's the concept, right? It's kind of <laughs> first come first. First come first served. Exactly. That's the point. So first come first served. It's done. Yeah. Okay. Now that's. No last look. Okay? So that's kind of the way you would expect oh, it. it. <laughs> the, well. And then, so what does last look means? Well, you know, you got to that price and uh, and the, yes, it was offered, but hey, the liquidity is gone. And you go, what, what is it? Where is it gone? And it could be gone because the problem is there's no single queue for this thing. So right in, in a, when it comes to exchange traded markets, typically all liquidity converges in one place. When it comes to exchange traded uh, like OTC markets, the same thing could be trading in lots of different places. So uh, basically, it's as if you, you get so let's say so Tottenham Court Road used to be the place where lots of people in London went to buy hi-fi, and uh, and uh, of course there was a lot of investment into stock. You know, people they would be really stocking pretty expensive speakers all the time. So if, if they saw that eventually there was some sort of shortage of, uh, of, of the speakers, they would say have some sort of offer outside the shop saying, hey, you know, super high end speaker for 10,000 bucks uh, going for going, going, gone. And then they realized that for whatever reason, you know, some magazine, you know, the, the Hi-Fi magazine had said, collection items, get it by all means. Then you come into the store and say, hey, I want the speaker for the offer of 10,000. They well, sorry, mate, you know, Hi-Fi magazine just came out with a, with a collection item recommendation. The price is now 15,000. Yeah. And that's the, the concept of a last look. It's a, you know, sorry, mate, but the, the market moved. And it, it could be true because, of course, the, there's no single market. There's, a, there's as many markets as shops there, there are in, in Tottenham Court Road. So that's the difference between uh, last look and uh, no last look. Um, as I said, last look, the, the FX market is the largest market which still operates on this basis. It's still disputable whether or not it's morally acceptable. Uh, I think gradually there are different venues which are putting an end to that. So at Darwinx, we operate, the, we aggregate the, be the best price feeds from a matching engine, which is LMAX, that operates on a no last look basis. And then we offer a last look feed from Saxo because in many cases, and I will talk, come back to that, it, it might be that last look actually gives a better price to the, to the end customer. And since we are a broker, we are in an obligation to find the best price in the market, period, regardless of our moral preferences.